14 slide to 16. So we have triplet 13, 14, 16 on the E. And then slide to 18. So. And then uh, pick the 18, whammy bar vibrato. If you don't have a whammy, just manually vibrato it. Section 2B, this is the clean part I played with the delay. And uh, my delay setting's not quite matched with it right now, but uh, minute 24 in. Um, palm mute most of this. I know the B string isn't palm muted, and one note on the G, but I'll, until we get there, palm mute everything. 15G, 13D twice, and then 1315 down up on the E, or on the, on the G. And this has got to be palm muted, like I said. And then up down on the 1315, so. And then 13DG, 15G, 13D. So we have 16B, no palm mute. And then 13D palm mute, 14B. So it's. And then in, uh, 13D to 16B again. So your high note will be. Thirteen DG. Double dots. Go back and play everything. No star, which is almost everything. Right here, we'll go thirteen sixteen DB. Then go thirteen. So we have fifteen B. Thirteen D palm mute. Sixteen G. 13 DG palm mute. That's the only difference. So instead of going, it'll be on that high melody. All right, that takes us to page five. Back to distortion. Not a lot happening right here. It's just 15 G, um, half step bend vibrato. 15 B, same thing, but it'll kind of hold the half step, no vibrato, and then release it. So you have 15, uh, just like you did at the beginning, and then go 13 G, 15 D G, and then repeat it, and then 15 G, break off of that. Um, and just like in the rhythm, everything's going to repeat now. You'll see that from the timestamp at 145. Just like your rhythm sections, all repeated, you'll see. It's the same thing with these lead sections, all repeats. So, good song, dude. Uh, nice little twist, doing an instrumental, too. So, have fun with it, man.